First up tonight, rescue crews are searching the Columbia River after a man fell out of a boat. Sadly, we are just learning this is now considered a recovery mission. Let's get Kendra Kent. She joins us now live near that search area in northeast Portland. Kendra. Yeah, that's right, Bonnie. And we have heard from a number of witnesses. Now they tell us that the person driving this boat was driving erratically close to the shoreline, doing cookies and speeding. And it was on a sharp turn when the boat then flipped over, tossing two people into the water. I'm going to show you where you can see those uh, recovery boats out right now looking for this man. The Multnomah County Sheriff's Office says this happened just before two this afternoon, leading to a rescue operation that again has now turned into a body recovery mission. The sheriff's office says the driver of the boat was able to get out to the shore, but the passenger, a man, was believed to have drowned here in the Columbia River. Investigators say the man was not wearing a life jacket, and witnesses tell us that other boaters rushed over to help after that boat turned over. Michelle Wood was watching from the beach, and she says a boater threw the struggling passenger a life vest, but then he went under and then he was just gone and there's tons of boaters out there trying to help search for him people on jet skis you know um, there's a lady out there on a paddle boat trying to search for him it was pretty intense and earlier today the coast guard sent a helicopter to look for this man and several search and rescue boats were dispatched right now we're told the dive team is in the water looking for his body and officials say that this is a tragic reminder that you should always wear a life jacket when you're in the water, boating or swimming. We'll keep you posted on the very latest. Reporting live in Northeast Portland, Kendra Kent, Fox 12, Oregon.